Hi, and welcome to this guidance lecture for Pass Criteria 5, which requires you to analyse the importance of employee relations in respect to influencing HRM decision making. So, to what extent is an organisation likely to consider employee relations when it makes decisions about its human resources? An organisation may have just completed a successful acquisition and there will be a multitude of issues coming out of this that HR management have to deal with. For example, is there an overlap between what employees in the acquiring and the newly acquired company are now doing? Is there now a need to transfer workers from one location to another? Are there inconsistencies in contracts or working conditions between the two companies? In other words, are employees in one company on a better deal than their peers in the other? Is there an imminent need for redundancies? And so on. So, in this scenario, to what extent might the company take into account employee relations? And presumably the benefits of maintaining good employee relations when making decisions about these issues? And then, away from this very specific scenario, how important is employee relations when making the day-to-day -day decisions that an HR function has to make? Decisions relating to things like drawing up job descriptions and contracts of employment, investment in staff training, appraisal systems, remuneration packages, recreational facilities like the ambience of the staff canteen, opportunities for career progression, disciplinary procedures, and so on. And finally, how important is employee relations in relation to other HR decisions? For example, is good employee relations more important than the need to comply with employment law or the need to meet wider organisational objectives like raising profit or increasing productivity?